All right, so here's one more thing I want to talk to you about. Uh, this goes back to the remote start system. Okay, so you got the vehicle started, right? You got the smart key here. You're wondering, oh, well, uh, where do I put the key in the ignition to go ahead and crank it up, right? Okay, well, let's take a look at that real quickly. Again, some of this stuff that I'm covering right now, you know, to you may be... You know, it may be what it is. You know exactly this information already. But again, I do want to advise there is some people out there that haven't ever owned a car with this much technology in it, and they may need that information. So anyways, you got the key. It's in your pocket or purse. You don't ever have to take the key out of your pocket or purse when you got a smart key, okay? You just go up to the car, open it up. But we'll sit that down right there for just a minute. So, uh, okay, and it's pretty self-explanatory. It tells you right here, which I'm just now noticing. To start driving, press the brake plus push the start button, okay? So Honda really has thought of it all. I'm going to go ahead and put my new croc on the park or on the brake. Then I will hit this button here. And look, the car still cranked up, but now it is alive and ready to drive. How about that? Does that sound good? And of course, they're going to let you know for safety purposes, please fasten your seatbelt. Loving the digital screen there in the middle. Very nice. This is really nice as well. As you can see, it's nice and big, pretty sweet. It looks like they almost integrated a iPad right into the dash or even a Samsung tablet. Just bow, put it right in there. Let's have at it and have a good time. Let's check out a few more great features now that I have the vehicle cranked. 